Welcome Capricorns. This is the first week of April. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. I am so happy to see you. How was your week? A message just fell out. All right, Capricorns, this week is from March 30th until April 5th. And a message just came out. We're going to be looking at that message. But as usual, I have changed up the reading. Let me know how you find this one. Um, because I've changed it up a lot. And um, please remember to share, share, share these videos. Go check out your monthly readings. The love readings is going to be coming up. So Capricorn, what is your message? All right, so Capricorn, you're dealing with um, something, um, a, young, um, a young fire sign person. Whoever this young fire sign person is, the energy of the journalist. Now, this is the Herb and Tarot deck, and in each deck, each people, um, each person um, have and uh, a different meaning, okay? Each um, situation have a different meaning. Now, in this Urban deck, this is a, um, a card deck where um, it's like modern day time, okay? So it has something to do with journalism, and it has something to do with information, okay? Because this is the Prince of Wands. This is the messenger of information. So it could be um, the newspaper. Um, it could be something on internet. Or whatever you're doing with media, this could be a very, very good week for that, okay? So, angels and guys, let's see. Ooh, what's coming out? Okay, so I see the eight of indulgency the eight of cups the eight of cups so i see some of you whatever this is is for someone out there um first we have this young fire sign person and you turn your back to this young fire sign person whoever this person is and whatever is going on i see indulgence this is the eight of cups turning your back so whoever this fire sign person is could have turned their back to you or you're turning your back to them okay so, um, and if your question, if you had a question, it's no. Okay. So, all right. So uh, that came up for someone who wanted to know something. So if you have a question, um, it's a no. All right. So let's see what's coming up for the Capricorns. Um, here we have the energy of the Angman. Okay. We have the energy of the Angman on Monday. Um, however, this is happening Tuesday we have the energy of the Prince of Cups. So um, this is a young um, Pisces. Then we have the Prince of uh, um, Pentacles. That is you, you young men. Um, but you're coming up in the reverse form. So there could be a situation with um, a Pisces woman. Maybe you're in a relationship with a Pisces woman. And you could be seeing the truth about the Pisces woman. Or you could be in a relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, and you're seeing the truth. So the energy of the cup is about new love is going to be coming in. And this new love that is coming in is for some of you with a Pisces person. Then we have the energy of the Queen of Swords in the reverse. Now this is the painter. Whatever is transpiring, this Queen of Swords is in the reverse. Some of you could have been dealing with... Um, and Aquarius, Gemini, or Libran, this person is in the reverse. So however that is coming up and transpiring. Then we have the energy of the Knight of Swords. Whoever this person is, I see as if this Knight of Swords, the Queen of Cups, and this Knight of Swords, whatever is transpiring, I see the hangman moment where you're seeing something about them. Then we see the Ten of Swords, they are ruined. Whatever is transpiring, their love, their relationship is ruined. Whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, um, um, I see um, the energy of uh, the Knight of Cups is here in the center. So you're dealing with a lot of a fire sign, a water sign, emotional people. But what is so beautiful about this is that uh, whoever tried to ruin you and whatever that was going on, I see love is coming out because um, the cup of uh, the ace of cups is here because it's as if 
people are seeing the situation as to what has been transpiring people tried to lie and the lie came out and it has to do with a gemini whoever this gemini is the gemini is the game master this is the knight of swords so this could be an investigation where people tried to ruin you and I see the truth come out because this is um, the game master. The game master is someone who will create games and illusionary and they try to ruin you. But now the truth came out. So this is in the foundation and this is absolutely, absolutely fabulous. Now, um, young men between the age of 18 and, and, and 35, you got to be aware of what is transpiring. 18 to 45 be aware of what is transpiring because whatever is transpiring in your world you're in the reverse opposite um a pisces cancer or a scorpion so i see um a situation where the house is transpiring um however this house is coming up i see um you because i said the um you men um could be having an issue with a house or with a business all right so I'm going to put it back because it just flips up and see what is coming out. So this is the energy of whoopsie daisy. All right. Okay. All right. So this was a false woman. It flamed out there. Now I see the Knight of Cups. Um, all right. So I see a widower. The Knight of Cups is a widower and he's waiting he's waiting what he's waiting on a new love so whoever um is dealing with a pisces cancer scorpion um i see this pisces cancer scorpion is a widower and he is waiting like he's waiting for you to come in because here it is all right and he's a widower um his wife has died and he's waiting for someone new to come in he wants um to be with you so if you're a woman and you know this um pisces cancer or scorpion person um his wife could have died he's a widower or a pensioner he's waiting for you to come in so whoever is out there watching this you should know who you are because it, this man wife has died and you or he is waiting for you because I see waiting okay and here you can see the waiting all right let's, let's go in I see a message that came out some of you were dealing with an Aquarian Gemini or woman this woman was false as what and the truth came out about this woman so it could be um, you know someone a, a friend or um, a relative whoever this person is or whatever was going on some um, someone was trying to um, access your information get in your information whoever this woman is is very false and it came out that she was not who she said she was okay she's totally ruined now and it could be um, a Gemini so I see a lot of you dealing with Gemini's women and men Okay, all the women and men, but it could also be an investigation. But it's something that is very false. It's not really um, the same. So what should the Capricorns know for the first week of April 2020? What should the Capricorns know? All right, the energy of the hangman comes up with money. So I see some of you Capricorns are hanging in, waiting for some money to come in. So however this is transpire. I see you could be finding out something about a lot of money or you could be just waiting for your pay to come in this could be a situation or waiting on some financial help to come in so however this is transpiring and this is happening I see a wait you're waiting on some money or seeing the truth to some money or finding out something about some money now I see um, all hope is gone um, for um, a Pisces um, woman whoever I say Pisces but it can be a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this is uh, your emotion hopeless hopelessly emotion whatever is transpiring I see that some of you are really hopelessly emotion however it is your emotion you're hopeless your emotion you're just hopeless hopelessly emotion for some of you um, young ladies out there or some of you um, this is affecting a, um, 
accumulative of people i see some hopeless emotion hopeless emotion over a pie um a pisces cancer or a scorpion person however that is affecting you now young men young capricorn men you got to be aware of your pleasure seeking okay this can take you in some serious places so you young capricorn men is on um uh, um, an honor roll to take your own self down with some pleasure seeking be aware of it because i see so, some of you men are going to be pleasure seeking with someone who is married and their husband is going to take you down you're going to be ruined your life okay i see um the ace of cups the ace of cups and the thief <laughs> it has to come up for a capricorn so some of you is connected with someone new but this person is very deceptive okay um it can be a cheater you could be um starting out with someone new a new love is a cheater okay atef ace of cup is a cheater okay so be aware of this because whoever this person is is playing on your emotional it's a um it's a deceptive person is a is a cheater okay so if you meet someone new, do not go in that relationship because that person is a cheater. You got to be aware of what is happening around you. Again, some of you, um, an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra or some of you, whoever this person, if, if you're a lawyer, be careful because whatever you have done is going to be coming out. Okay, so if you're a lawyer and you have done something deceptive it's going to be coming out people are going to be seeing the truth of who you are it's going to be coming out however that is plain for you because i see that you have done um some deceptive situation and i see the truth is going to be coming out so um you know however that is coming up be aware people knight of swords whatever the energy is knight of swords I see um, this person coming towards you, okay? So this person is a traveler. This person is coming towards you. Whatever is transpiring, I see this person is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, and this person is coming towards you, okay? Um, however, this person is coming from a distance, coming towards you, whoever this person is. Then we see the Ten of Swords, Ruin, and it is half... Uh, and um whatever is transpiring with you lawyers i don't know what is transpiring but there is an um an aquarian gemini this is a gemini woman um and the energy of ruin in the reverse and i see a wife so what is transpiring here is that um someone um wife uh, or if you were a wife you felt um as if your life is ruined by someone because you found out that your partner is cheating on you because the ace of cups and the teeth is on the top and this is you so if you're a wife you're going to be finding out that your husband i've been cheating on you there is a new love in your husband world because you're a wife with kids and um you're finding out that your husband has been cheating on you um and uh, there's the ace of cups pleasure seeking um so you men um who are pleasure seeking out there because you're in the reverse form and there's pleasure seeking you men um your wife if you are in a relationship your wife is going to find out exactly what you have been doing so yeah money is here we're going to be seeing what is happening with the money lawyers i'm a little bit worried yeah a resolution is coming out for the money i said we are going to find out what is happening to the money a resolution is coming out for money so if money was stolen or however it is i see some of you are waiting on some money um but a resolution is going to be coming out about the money um i don't know what you know if you um if you are in if you have a friend or you're in a relationship with an aquarian gemini or libra person um the person is false the person is tricky and the person is a fox um it could be um someone at your work the person is false okay and the person is a fox so whoever this person is and whatever this person has done um i see their true colors is going to be coming out because they're in the reverse 
um and there is it could be um your is a colleague or a friend it could be your partner okay all right so we see um an end is coming to um a woman or um an end to some emotional hopelessness that some of you have so some of you have some emotional hopelessness i see that it's going to be coming to an end it's as if you have given up you feel hopeless in whatever way however that is transpire maybe you're just at home alone and everyone is busy with their lives however that is feeling it is going to be over okay in this week what i'm also seeing is that some of you who are in a relationship with a pisces cancer or scorpion lady this is over whatever this lady has done i see that this relationship or this friendship is over so um yeah that is coming up then i see um ladies now this as the energy of uh, you men and a lady your pleasure seeking with this lady this lady is a married lady i did said it i am hey i did say that oh my god i said it all right so you men um between the ages of 18 and 45 is pleasure seeking with a lady but the lady is a married lady i said it and here it is it is a married lady whoever this person is is um a high aristocratic lady um your pleasure seeking with this person is not someone you want to be in a relationship with it's just someone that you're looking for pleasure with but this woman is married and this woman husband is a, a very powerful man be aware of what you guys are doing because you're going to be finding yourself in some serious problem because you can't keep your pen zip close okay all righty so we're moving on because i said it and here it is it's coming out new love yes um some of you are cheating um on someone is someone from the past okay so the ace of cups someone from the past is coming back but this person is a cheap cheater stay away from this person this person is a cheater so i see someone from the past is coming back the energy of the ace of cups love but the thief is on top of it that means it's a cheater and this is someone who you have known from past life he's coming back but um it, it, it is a is a player and a cheater so um it is your um decision with this person fox so 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 remember i told you about that lady and the fox um the lady and the fox is back because um whatever is transpired this aquarian person is a fox or you guys could be telling things that is not true some of you are dealing with someone on the work floor that is very false however this person is this could be however this is coming up this is a very false person twice the energy of the facts is like the universe is saying be aware of this person because this person is not being honest this person is an aquarian gemini or libran she is uh, um, not honest whatever is transparent and I'm going to look deeper in her she have twice the energy of the fox so she is as false as what okay very false person you gotta be aware of uh, this person now I see conflicts um, I see someone is coming from a journey or um, some illusion uh, situation with a legal situation but I see that someone is coming from on a journey to you or so. However, that is transpiring. But I see conflicts between you and this person. I see huge conflicts between you and this person. This person is, in, is also an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. All right. So what I see here is that uh, um, I see lies and deceptiveness and a wife um, your wife is going to be finding out about some lies and deceptiveness and some falseness with your partner. So you're going to be finding out some of you that your partner has been cheating or your partner was seeing someone else. 
I see that you married women because you are the wife is finding out some deceptiveness about an invitation so whoever you are is like an invitation came in and you're finding out that this invitation is false however it is transpiring so there is a, a situation with a house I see a widower um, with a house and I see some of uh, this person is waiting waiting for some information so it has to do with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it could be that this person wants to reunite it could be that your relationship has ended with the Pisces cancer or scorpion and they want to return home okay so um that is a situation that is coming up so be aware of what is transpiring because it's really a weird week for you Capricorns now let's look at what is coming up with this um, um with this um situation okay so your heart breaks about some money is in reverse so there was some money that was supposed to come to you it didn't come to you because they find out that there was some falseness the truth is coming up out about this money but I see a resolution okay then I see the energy of the six of ones. You're going to be receiving some good news. So whoever that feel, felt hopeless um, with a situation or hopeless over a situation that you were in, some good news is going to be coming in. Um, you're going to be receiving some good news. Then I see the energy of uh, um, the king of wands. Okay. Um, whoever this king of wands is, this is the man for the wife so you men who are fooling around a woman this woman husband is the king of wands now um whatever pleasure seeking you're having with this married lady her husband is about to find out and he's going to make your life very miserable so you know people need to understand to train yourself um, then we have the ace of a cups so I see some of you is um, someone um, as return in your life this person you have known for quite some time you're starting out with them but they are a cheater okay ace of cup with a thief is a cheater okay so be aware of that so you can start and it's something new with this person but it's a cheater now whatever is uh, transpiring i see some of you ladies who is dealing with an aquarius gemini or libra person um whatever the issue and the situation that is transpiring there is some real emotional situation and the emotional situation is over a scorpion whoever the scorpion is and whatever is transpiring there is uh, whoever the scorpion is is a um is someone at your work it's a woman and it's a very deceptive woman um this is it so um ladies whoever you are um if you were dealing with a scorpion at your work she's very very deceptive because she if your manager or someone who is an aquarian gemini or libra is above you this woman is taking message to um this woman is taking message to someone as a very false person and it is a scorpion so Whoever is working with a scorpion at your work, you better be careful because they're taking news to higher up and they're taking lies and deceptiveness to higher up. So be aware. This woman is really false and it's a scorpion woman. It's a very deceptive lady, very false lady. Keep away from her. Now, the energy with the journey, the, um, this is uh, someone who is a voyage and it has to do with your materialistic stability. Now, this voyage could be that you are going on a voyage or this voyage is being taken, but I see a lot of conflicts. I see a lot of conflicts with people. Um, it could be with people in power. However, this conflicts is, I see a lot of conflicts, but you're like standing back and looking at them and thinking, hey, I've worked hard for this. Figure it out yourself, but um, this is mine. And it is good because yay, yay, yay. You are going to be overcoming this, whatever this deceptiveness is and whatever that is transpiring. You're going to be overcoming this because you're going to be aptly overcoming this. This came out also um, for um, a, a wife. A wife is going to receive uh, an invitation and the invitation is uh, um, to go out. Okay, so um your wife there's some lies and deceptiveness so if you're a wife 
you're married with a kid, you receive an invitation, an invitation to go out. Okay. Um, but this invitation could be, um, there is something about this invitation that you don't trust. Whatever it is, it is, there is just something about this invitation that you don't trust. Now, listen to your guts, and this is for the wives, okay? Because whatever the invitation is, you you are just not trusting this invitation for whatever the reason is, is, and you are right about that, okay? I see the energy of the queen of hat. Whoever this queen of hat is, is an older woman, and I see that um, this older woman is uh, passed away, and I see that this person could be your mom and your mom is just waiting. There is something with a house. It's as if, if your mom was a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion and has passed away, she left you a house, but it's as if your brother or your cousin or some other family member wants this house. It has to do with a house. So, and I see that your father is like um, um, weeping the morn, but the morn is on um, his son or his young daughter, but it's his son because the daughter is there. So there is some weeping and mourning that is going on for this man because he's a widower, okay, of his wife being passed away. He's still weeping and mourning. And this house that is left... I see that a young, um, a young Pisces Cancer or Scorpion man is as if he wants to take the a house or, and you're like, hell no, I don't think so. Did you ever look at your, your grandparents or your parents when, um, they were sick? No, uh, you have never go visit your grandparents. And all of a sudden you are trying to, um, take something that is not yours. So I see that there is some deceptive play that is going on whatever the deceptive play is um it is with someone that has died and left a house and i see that it's as if this husband is weeping for this house when this house wasn't even is a bloody thief so his wife passed away left a house but the house was not for him the house is for you and i see he's weeping and mourning over a house and waiting and waiting and waiting oh bloody hell stupid ass now, however way um, that is going on, ladies and gentlemen, just stop and walk away from this thing because uh, hold on to your house. Whoever this young Pisces Cancer Scorpion is, is just waiting for your house or waiting for you to die so that you can get this house. And I will say to you, ladies and gentlemen, ask for a personalized reading, okay? I just wanted to get through something, but it's okay. I wanted to see, ooh, new love is coming in. Definitely, definitely. An intuitive person, a sensitive person, an artistic person, and a friendly person. A new person enters your life. A relationship begins a new phase. Heightened psychic ability for some of you. So another really romantic week for you heard sign people new love is coming in but the point is that this new love is a cheater so it's good it's nice sparkle sparkle um so however this is going i'm wishing you really a wonderful week gotta go gotta go